Okay, guys, welcome we'll back to Let's Play Paper Mario. Just Paper Mario, sorry, I need to burp. Um, last time we last off, we were fighting this pokey fight. And we're just about to win. Kaboom! And y'all won. I win. Give my money. Give my money. Gotta get the money. And. Yeah, I'm gonna join you soon. In the next god knows how many minutes. I got a beat. Ha ah, Danny, what did you I get? Got a beat, yeah. Uh, get Bombette out again. You're gonna be switching party members a lot throughout this dungeon. Oh, you don't have it. I don't have much. Okay, now what I want to do right now is the blast with this and use the power up thingy. This is a super block. You power up party members by giving them new abilities. So who I'm gonna upgrade? I'm gonna upgrade this guy. Why this guy is because he's actually the more useful ones. And they're still playing. Can't do nothing in this room again. Wow, you're being so creative in this game. Kind of have to be. What? Paper. Playing. I'm playing paper. And mine's waiting for players. There we go. Yeah, they get smaller per time, so. Each enemy has a different hitbox. That is the probably smallest hitbox you'll see. You quit, you jerk. What else did you want me to do? I was, I'm playing though, okay. Yeah, they're probably gonna have hell. So yeah, are all three of us gonna be recording together? Sweet. Yeah, you heard it from me, guys. We're going to be recording Osu when all three of us are on. Eventually, all four of us, because there's a friend who wants to play with us all the time. Well, he's my friend, but... Yeah. He's a very okay-ish Osu player. He's Toon Link Gaming. Yeah, this walkthrough is dedicated to Toon Link Gaming, and he's also an Osu player. That I got him into playing. Playing, uh, Paper Mario on. Yeah, I like five million times before this recording started. And Yep. I thought, I thought Mario was for um, SNES. Yeah, Mario Mario was for SNES. Oh, oh, we're talking about something different now, okay. Yeah. Ah, confusion. Whoa, there's somebody else here. I was composing. I was too. Yeah. I'm just schizophrenic. You're schizophrenic, that's funny. I'm arguing with myself. Oh, yeah. This is going nowhere and there's a thunderstorm outside. Yeah, there's no storm outside. Here. Over here, this. Trying to get the storm. God damn it. Mm -hmm. Made a wrong turn, guys. You didn't have to come down here until a little later. Everyone's probably staring at their computer screen saying, Why did you just mess up this dungeon? It's not messing up, I just did this in a wrong order. Okay, now for the right order. I'm supposed to come to this side, use whatever his face is on this side. Get over here, and we got a puzzle. I really hate this puzzle. What you gotta do, you gotta do this. So that switches up the order of everything. Now we gotta do. We gotta do it again on the other side now. Now what I used to do, I used to jump down and take it the exact same way. But I found an easier way of just doing this. So just follow my lead and you'll be a okay. Is it weird that I'm almost trying, but now I don't know why my first time playing this game this help this puzzle gave me so much hard work and to do. But it's quite easy. Just go woo Open the treasure chest and got a super hammer Our hammer strength was increased and now we can break the grave blocks like this. Now remember that room I said we couldn't do nothing to until we had a certain upgrade. Well, go back to the room, which was this room. 
Now, get ready to go backtracking to Articado, whatever his name is. This current game is a game you concentrate on or you suck. I'm not really concentrating. I can play this game with like 1% of concentration. No, Paper Mario, you don't really have to concentrate. You just have to do things. You just have to do some level grinding. I'm not level grinding. The funny thing is, I can do this game under leveled. I've done it before on my spare time. Uh -huh, I won. What now? Oh, you didn't let me win. Okay, let's do a super hard song. Oh, do the Kaon song, dude. That's really hard. Get this one. So yeah, just go down from where you are from the temple, and you should get to the, the campsite with the turtles. I'm the Koopas, because they're called Koopas in this goddammit. And you should be on the right track. You gotta give the artifact to the professor. Oh god. God, god, god. There's a bandit pokies on my butt. Don't want. Go away. Need a run. Bandit. Okay. Yeah, we got artifact. Give him the artifact, and what do you get? You get our heart. Um, I almost call it a piece of heart. Wow. Too much Legend of Zelda for me. A star piece. So, back to the temple. Oh, God. Back to the... What was that one show? Hidden of the Temple or whatever? That was all Mac and whatever his face is. Legends of the Hidden Temple. There we go. Legends of the Hidden Temple. Danny, why'd you leave? Why not? Ah, uh, this is gonna go on forever. Ah, uh, the pokies, pokies, so I wanna fight pokies. Okay, so back to the temple of the hidden monkey shrine or whatever. Save. Please, if you're not good at the battle mechanics, save there. Don't refight the pokies. Run right past. Now, there is a secret. Any other RPG? Uh, uh, They're talking about uh, stuff I shouldn't care about. Hit this. And whoa! Chain Chop's alive. Chain Chop's alive. Still golden Chain Chop's alive. Chain Chop's alive. It's the thing in the background of the one area where you get the whatever it was. Austin, you gotta go check out my videos. Oh, wow. Oh, you jerk. They're funny, actually. Ow. Ow, only the second one is. The first one's just explaining stuff. So, yeah. Almost <laughs> done with the film so I could actually stop and play Osu with my friends. <laughs> Great, this temple shouldn't take too much longer. Oh, yes, there's a reason why I want to collect every one of those. What? One's a pyramid, one's a star, and one's um I don't know what the other one is. Um, crescent moon, I think. One's a triangle, one's a star, one's a star. Ah, ah, it was under the block, under the block, oh god. I do not like stone chain chomps. I don't care what if they say they're chomps, they're chain chomps, because there's chains on the chomps. That's a chain chomp, guys. If you haven't played any Mario games, you should realize what a chain chomp is. Oh, before any smart ass says, chain chomps are the ones that are iron. No, they're not. Anything that has a chain and looks like a chomp is a chain chomp. Again, we got the diamond. Great. Only one more to find, and then we gotta do a puzzle, which I hate. Nah, don't wanna fight, don't wanna fight, go away. Nah, Buzzy Beetles, I don't like Buzzy Beetles. Hit this. Jump on the question mark thingy. Exclamation mark, I should say. And now, 
we made stairs. What they do. So while making stairs, we gotta do something else now. This game just has a lot of puzzles that are simple, but like take forever to do. How did I get, how did the enemy get a first strike on me? You know what, I'm too lazy. Fireballs! Get a fire flower in the face! Oh sure, those things can block. Whoops, didn't mean to do that. I did not mean to do that. That was a bad move on my end. Really bad move on my end. Oh my god, I'm, I'm screwed. Unless I could kill the bat. That I might be saved. I'm saved. I'm saved. I just need to get one shell shock. Yeah, there. I won. I'm saved. Because I'm recording. I have to do the commentary. Oh god, these people are not helpful whatsoever. I'm not doing commentary with them again unless they're individual. Never again as a group. Yep. We fail. Okay, now this. I hate this puzzle. This puzzle took me forever as a kid because I did not realize what you're supposed to do until much later. So. Oh, the chain chomps. They look exactly like the ones in that one room before. I wonder what that could mean. Yeah, there's a, there's your description of how you're supposed to do it. So, last time you play this game, so it's dun dun dun. Okay, got it. So the crescent moon goes on this side. The diamond goes into this. The pyramid goes into that. Now all we need is the crescent moon. Where's the crescent moon? I wonder. Yeah, we gotta go over here. Crescent moon is on this side. Now ready for the hardest fight in the game? Not really. This isn't not the no that this fight is nowhere near the hardest fight. Shit, the second boss I find the hardest fight in the whole game. Really? I'm being dead serious. I found that the hardest. Probably because I always do under levels for some strange reason. I may have lost most respect for you. Well, if I do under level, then I was stupid as a kid. Come on. Yeah, pretty much. Well, I'm sorry that he gave me so much trouble as a kid. And I'm fighting him. Now to get my revenge. I have beat this game five times on the original cartridge. And ten times on a virtual console. So hopefully I have enough practice. Ten times on a virtual console? That's quite a bit. I know, I got bored. <laughs> really bored. Okay, so I'm gonna have to stop. Well, actually, no, I could, I could record for a bit longer. Heal point, which I really want to use. And there is supposed to be a save point. Where's the save point? Save point! Now, he gave us a final warning to leave the temple, but tough crap, this is the major point of the fight. Now, I hate this boss. He does like, you know, this most crazy, I'm dead, look at me, fear me. But, really, he's pretty easy. It's just that stupid chain chomp. So what you gotta do, is we gotta fight him. The king whatever. Now, I'm, now I'm gonna stop it here, because this fight's gonna take me quite some time. Until next time.